just a demonstration of an operating steam engine. Here's the whistle. And then to start this, you would just do that. If you have a lot of steam, it'll start by itself. And it'll lose control if you're not careful. And this right here is called the governor. And if you had a, like a small generator that comes with it, hook it up to there with one of those black things and then you can generate your own electricity. And to do it, to make this thing go backwards, you have to shut this off. And then you pull that to put it, make it go back. Words. And then you gotta make it do that. That's how you start it by yourself. See? See, this is how you start it by yourself. If it don't go first, do that. And for all things can go fast, but this one can go surprisingly slow if you want it to. Like right. Like right there. See, and I like to run the whistle when this thing's running. So it's like an actual operating steam engine. And then, just a sec. This is a tool that can help you read the temperature, but it's not always accurate. So, this it says that this would be, this right here would be 125.4 degrees Fahrenheit. And down there where you put the oil, the fuel in, it is 345 degrees. And these are what you put in it. And you, for it depends on what model you have. If you have a 75 like this one, you need exactly three of these. Now only 20 cubes come in. And it's called Cam Cook Solid Fuel. And um, here's the whistle one more time. Wait, before I do that, this right here. See when you're making it go slow? See how that thing pumps slower? And then when it's going fast, see how it pumps really fast? Now it's surprising that that can do that. And this thing has, if you have this thing on fast, watch, I'll move this towards you. Look how much water sprays out. Ow. See? And if you get this stuff wet, then the thing will not work. And right now, those two together are two hot, no, to suck. That right there is 271.7 degrees Fahrenheit. Now to push the cubes in, if you're starting it for, starting it again, um, you might want to use a screwdriver or um, or a key or something that won't catch fire. And when you do that, um, you push it in there. But if you put it too far, it will not make steam or I don't know. And this is what you use, like when you're starting it for the first time, you would twist this open and put exactly half water in there. But if you t put too much in, it'll start leaking right there. Okay, so we'll do the whistle one more time, and then I'll show you that thing running one more time. <laughs> 